For this problem, we want to look at a polynomial and determine whether it's a monomial, a binomial, or a trinomial. That means we need to count the number of terms. Terms within a polynomial are completely separated by addition and subtraction signs. Then if there's one term, it's a monomial, two terms is a binomial, and three terms is a trinomial. Once we've identified that, then we will look at the degree of the polynomial, which is the highest degree on any um, of the variable terms. So we look at the variable and identify the highest power. So let's look at our polynomial, which is 9x plus 6x squared minus 4. We can see the addition and subtraction signs completely separate these to make one, two, three terms. And because there are three terms, that means it's a trinomial. Looking at those three terms, we have a variable term here with no exponent, which means the power is 1. We have a variable term here with an exponent of 2, which means the power is 2. Here, there's no variable, which means the power is 0. So that means 2 is the highest power, which means this is a second degree polynomial. Um, so it's a trinomial is the type of polynomial, and 2 is the degree of the polynomial.